Hello, I'm Edward and welcome to WindowsReport.com. In this video, I will show you what to do when UNet boot in is not working in Windows 10. UNet boot in is a cross platform utility that can create live USB systems and can load a variety of other system utilities. Sometimes it may fail to work and the issue is most likely caused by a corrupted ISO file or a bad flash drive. So let's take a look at how we can solve this problem in no time. For a more detailed explanation and even more solutions, please check the article in the description below. The first solution could be changing the BIOS setup. To do that, just press the start button in the lower left corner and then click the settings icon. Then go to update and security. Open the recovery tab from the left pane, scroll down to advanced startup and click the restart now button. After the restart, just select the troubleshoot option. Under advanced options, just choose the UFE firmware settings. Then confirm the restart and this will allow you to enter BIOS on your Windows 10 PC. After entering the BIOS, just open the boot tab, then set the UFE slash BIOS boot mode to legacy. Save the changes and exit BIOS. Then restart your PC and try to boot with the live USB. Another great solution could be disabling secure boot. To do that, just restart your PC, then start pressing F2 to access the BIOS. Then in the BIOS, open the security tab. Highlight and choose default secure boot on and set it as disabled. Save the changes and exit BIOS. Then reboot the computer with the live USB connected and check if the fail to start UNet booting error is resolved. You can also try disabling the fast startup. Click the start button in the lower left corner and simply type control panel. And click control panel. When control panel opens, locate and click on power options. Click on choose what the power button does. Now click on change settings that are currently unavailable and disable turn off fast startup. Reboot the computer and check for any improvements. And another great solution is fixing the Windows bootloader using Windows 10 USB. Make sure you have the Windows 10 installation media ready. If not, you have to create the Windows 10 bootable flash drive and then proceed. Afterwards, boot from the media and choose repair your computer. Then click on the troubleshoot option. Next, select advanced option and choose command prompt. In the command prompt, type the following command one by one and hit enter. You also have to make sure that the EFI system partition is using the FAT32 file system. And run the following command to assign a drive letter to the partition that is not in use. Then to repair the boot record, run the following command. Wait for the command to find and fix issues with the bootloader. And restart the PC once the repair is complete. For more information and details, please check the article in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.